Now that we've drawn some of our base architectural elements, I'm going to ungroup these really quickly. I'm going to copy this over, just complete the enclosure. And for this purpose, just for representational purposes, we're going to stretch that into place. I'm going to copy this over to this side. One thing I want to do is I want to shrink this all down to 10 feet. So a little trick we can do here is first I'm going to use the move edge command. And I'm going to select all the top edges of these columns and I'm going to move them down to meet the top of this edge. And then I'm going to select all the top edges of all these walls and I'm going to move those down. What that did was that moved the top edges of my surfaces down to 10 feet above the slab. I'm going to make a copy of this real quick, rotate this into place, move this here, and then we're going to create one more little segment here, like that. Here is our enclosure, except for one final wall that we'll draw in a second. Now if I go back to my layers and I turn on my roof and my beams, I can move these things down into place. One thing I can do is I can select all of my beams at once. In my layers window, I can right click on the layer name and select objects. And that's going to select every object in the layer. And then from there, I can move these down into place. Typically, I want to move this exactly into place. So now these are going to be resting on top of those columns. And I don't want to move my roof down quite yet.